Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 37 in chapter 8. This chapter is about the conservation of energy. As you can see in this simple model, we have a box connected with a spring. As the initial position, uh, you can see this spring is compressed. So the position for this spring is negative 0.04 meter. We take the balanced position as the uh, Zero. Okay, this one. So it compressed 0 0.0205 meter, and then the initial velocity is zero. Then we release the box. The box will move to position two, and at the position two, it is still get stationary. V two is zero, and the x two is 0 0.023 meter, and so this is a very simple problem, right? The box connected with spring just move backwards. We need to find the coefficient for kinetic friction. So what means the coefficient for kinetic friction? That means we must consider the friction force in this process. And also, when the box moves from the left to the right, the friction is just backward, agree? And the distance is upward. So the work done by the friction it's just a FD negative, and then the energy it, but the, the this uh, friction work converted to thermal energy. Agree? Yes. So in this one, we consider the energy is conserved. The initial energy, the kin initial kinetic energy plus initial potential energy equals to the final energy, final kinetic energy plus five final potential energy. And also the thermal energy when this friction do the work. Agree? So this thermal energy is the friction times the distance it covered. The distance it this distance the cover displacement it covers x2 minus x1. So this friction very easily is just a mu k mg, mu k mg. Then we input the known quantities inside. You can see the x1 is given, x2 is given, mu k is given. So very easy, uh, the k is given. Very easily, you can find this mu k, 0 0.4. Thank you.